Hey guys, Brianne Schoen Brown here, physical therapist and wellness coach. Get your fixed physical therapy, get your fixed nutrition, CrossFit coach with CrossFit Majestic. And I work with CrossFitters and runners to get you from injury to PR in eight to 12 weeks. So we're on this hip and leg strengthening series right now for you runners. So we've spent time doing some good glute and hamstring work with the RDLs, single leg RDLs. Uh, today I wanted to get into some of our rotators. So our rotator muscles in our hips actually help do, um, give us good stability. So when we are stepping, we aren't turning that knee inward. So this is one, a lot of people in, if you've gone to therapy before, uh, do what's called a clamshell. I like this version of it because it puts you in a weight bearing position. It puts you in the actual position that you're going to be running in, which is on your feet. So for this one, just need some sort of resistance loop. Um, you can get these easily online. But what you're gonna do around your knees, you're gonna go into a slight little squat stance. Basically, I just call it your ready stance. So if you think of most athletic, um, most sports, um, they kind of have this like ready stance so they're ready to move any position. So from there, you're gonna just keep one leg right where it's at. The other leg, you're gonna go slightly on its toe. From there, just going to um, keep both feet planted and you're gonna rotate that hip out and back in. So everything stays nice and stable through here. Um, I want you to rotate the entire pelvis. So you're just in this position, pelvis stays facing forward, rotating that hip out and coming back in. If you're doing this properly, you're actually going to feel it working on both sides. You're gonna feel it stabilizing on the stance leg and you're gonna feel it activated on the moving leg. So for these muscles, they are endurance muscles. They need to be able to work for long periods of time. So this is something that you want to do fairly low resistance, but lots of reps. So I'm talking like three to four sets of 20 on these on both legs. So we can really work the endurance part of these muscles um, through this activity. So let me know the questions you have regarding this. Any comments you have regarding this, um, post those on here as well. And as usual, if you have any specific questions, feel free to reach out to me on Facebook Messenger. I'd be happy to have a conversation with you. So hope you're having an amazing Thursday. Have a great rest of your day, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.